Predicting the minute ventilation requirement based on ideal body weight has been adopted from Radford's nonogram. This table provides three calculations. The 100% minute ventilation requirement, the additional minute ventilation requirement if using a HME or heat moisture exchanger, and the minute ventilation requirement for somebody with metabolic acidosis. The only inputs needed for this table are patient's height in either inches or centimeters and the patient gender for which side of the table you're going to use, male in blue, female in red or pink. Outputs include the ideal body weight in kilograms and the minute ventilation requirement. This table is simple to use. First, identify the gender of the patient to determine which side of the table you're going to use, the male side versus the female. Second, determine the height, measure the height of the patient. So, for example, let's say that this patient was only 61 inches and it was a male patient. That gives you their ideal body weight and their minute ventilation requirement which is 5.04 liters. And say if the patient was in metabolic acidosis, this gives you a range that they need approximately a liter more. So it just gets you in the range there. And that's how to use the table.